Look at here. Show how old this stuff is. You got many versions of this game, of, of the Simpsons game here. The Itchy and Scratchy show for the game. Genesis, Game Gear, Super Nintendo, and Game Boy. <laughs> okay, here's more. And this was a really surprise to me because I didn't even know this show even had a comic book. Uh, let alone anything else. Because it was just a show, but Married with Children had a comic book. This is the, I don't know if this is the first one or not, or the first episode or edition, I think. Or whatever. Or the 1994, annual 1994. You know, because it has Al on one side of James Bond and it has Peg on the other. This will definitely be worth keeping. And then they got this one here. Better Children's a special off Broadway. I didn't even know that they even had a comic book. I'm so surprised. That's pretty pretty weird, I guess. But it's okay. We also got some uh well, a collectible G.I. Joe comic book based on G.I. Joe. I don't know this is issue this is issue zero cover A. So I don't got pretty good graphics here though. This came out in two thousand eight, so this is like uh like G. I. Joe of today kinda. Maybe before they were promoting the movie. Huh. Huh. J. Joe Cobra. J. Joe Origins. Really cool stuff. And as far as last but not least on the comics here, sent me the first three out of four, anyway, editions of the Indiana Jones, the Tomb of the Gods. Must be a lost episode or something. But it came out in 2008, too, so. Must have been right after the movie came out. It's like continuing the story or something. <laughs> so who knows? I like Indiana Jones. I I I still gotta watch the other three movies. I watched the first one. I haven't seen the last three though. Okay, and then the other clanky he gave was uh, Underdog Singer. <laughs> Underdog. Underdog is here. Never fear. Okay, and, and last but certainly not least, he sent me a bunch of cards now. I was, well, actually, no, he, I'll show you this here. He actually did say, Happy Holidays, Frankie. Sent me this. The, uh, he didn't really have a title. He just, for this, it's just me as Frankenstein. <laughs> and funny thing about this is, do I really have a, a nose that, that big? It reminds me of Bert, from Bert and Ernie. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's too funny, though. He definitely is a creative genius, that Travis Beer Wagon. Okay. Last but not, certainly not least, uh, as most people say when they are getting to the end of their wire, he sent me, I'm thinking this is every, well, okay, he sent me the mask stuff, uh, the cow, or, uh, collectible cards, the mask, the mask returns, and stuff for the movie ask which is great but this is something that I never was expecting because I was actually funny story about this is that I was actually looking on eBay because I'm, I'm gonna be ordering some stuff from eBay here tomorrow when I get paid and these are one of the things that I was almost gonna order but they wanted too much for them and it's pretty much every all these collectible cards from the tops their movie cards from the original Batman. I wonder how he figured that I really wanted these. <laughs> I love it though because it's the original Batman. It's it's the Michael Keaton, the better, the better Batman. You know, I mean, uh, <coughs> I mean, it just goes perfectly with, with some of the Batman stuff I got. One of the things that I got, what that I ordered, 
you know, that I didn't show, that I, I don't think I've ever shown this, since I'm, I'm only showing this just because I got the, the Batman cards and whatnot, uh, is one of the things that I got, anyway, that I ordered from Amazon a long time ago was this poster here. Well, was it a, a poster? It's kind of a poster, but it's like a original artwork, anyway. Somebody did, like, a watercolor painting of Michael Keaton as Batman, and it was only $3.00. In some sense, from Amazon plus four dollars shipping, and I got here probably a good month or so ago, and uh, yeah, I mean it's pretty nice the detail and everything. You know, I mean if I could eventually find a frame for it or something, you know that would be nice. But it's hard to find stuff for 11 by 17 photos. But uh, anyway, thanks Travis for all the for for uh, finally uh, sending your package. And it was great to finally uh, receive it and show everybody what you know, what you uh, sent me anyway. And uh, to everybody else, uh, thanks for watching the video. Uh, this challenge was pretty interesting. I'm surprised it lasted as long as it did. But, uh, you know, I mean, it's kind of neat. Maybe sometime in the future we can always do this again. You know, if you ever want to do another challenge or something. This time let's step it up a little bit. You know, if, if you ever want to do something like that again. But, uh, yeah, other than that, that's all I have to say. Thanks very much, Travis. You rock, brother. And uh, <laughs> I'm Frankie Slauson.